The next question, Assalamu alaikum, my name is Sayyid Sayyan Hussain. I am a student and I live in Iran in the city of Bukhan. I am 16 years old. I was asked a question that I couldn't answer. And the question is, why are the color of people's skin different, whereas we are all born to a couple named Adam and Eve? And inshallah, this will be the last question for the session. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in the glorious Quran, in Surah Rum, chapter number 30, verse number 22, وَمِنْ آيَاتِهِ خَلْقُ السَّمَاوَاتِ وَالْأَرْضِ وَاخْتِلَافُ أَلْسِنَتِكُمْ وَأَلْوَانِكُمْ And among his signs, are that he created the heavens and the earth and the variations in the languages and in your color. So Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has created us in different colors and we human beings, we have different languages. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in the glorious Quran in Surah Hujurat, chapter number 49, verse number 13. Ya ayyuhal nasu, inna khalaqnaakum min dhakari wa untha wajalnaakum shu'uban wa qaba'ila li ta'arafu Oh mankind, we have created you from a single pair of male and female and divided you into nations and tribes so that you may recognize each other, not that you may despise each other. And the most honored among you in the sight of Allah is the most righteous of you. So the criterion for judgment in the sight of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, it is not caste, it is not color, it is not wealth, it's not gender, but it's righteousness. It is God consciousness. It is taqwa. It is piety. So the reason Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has made us into different nations, into different tribes, into different colors, the purpose is for recognition. And the one who's superior in the sight of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is not the one who has a particular color or because of his gender, etc. But the one who's superior in the sight of Allah is the one who has piety, is the one who has taqwa, is the one who is God conscious. Imagine if all of us human beings, we were of the same color. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has made us into different colors, into different nations, into different tribes. It is for recognition. And what makes us great in the sight of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, it is our taqwa, it is our good deeds, it is our righteous deeds.